In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make a professional animated intro for YouTube and film more X like this. I am gonna show you how to do it fast and easily using Film or IX. Hey everyone my name is Sali Ali. Welcome to Sali Tutorials. Before the video starts, I wanna tell you that you must have these things with you. Like I have, 1, background music. 2, text sound effect. 3, vector sound effect. 4, background video. 5, lens flare. Drag these 5 files to Film Aura. Add files to the timeline by numbers. Like I have background music at number 1. Add it to the timeline. Listen. Background music is something like this. Number 2 is the text sound effect. Add it to the timeline. You know we use these two sounds for text and vectors. Like there will be sound play with text and vector animation. Add intro background video. I want to show you the background video of the intro. Then go to text. And add the default title to the timeline. Name the title. As I name it Solid Tutorials. Then change the title font, choose a good font. As I choose La Bombolette Plane. 1.0 Apply nice styling to the title in the presets tab Double click to apply style Then go to the video tab and open transform Adjust text position Place the position Y box minus 60 And click OK Double click on text. And go to the animation tab. Here I choose the typewriter. Double click to apply animation. Click OK. Right click the text and copy the text. Click copy. Then lock the bottom layer and paste the text. Close the gap between the text. Select both texts and press ALT plus DELETE to close the gap. Increase the duration of this text. Double click on this text and remove the animation from it. Double click on NO ANIMATION. And OK. Then go to the media. And add lens flare to the timeline. Double click on Lens Flare and go to Transform. Open the Transform tab. Place the position Y box minus 60. Then go to Animation and click Customize. And move the Flare's X position to the start of the text. And adjust the scale. With the keyframe move the flare to the end of the text. And increase the scale of the flare in the end of the text. And zero the opacity level in the next keyframe. Let's see now. 
flare speed is lower than text speed. To do this, we need to reduce the length of the frame. I think it's OK now. Click OK. Show the track. Now go to text and add callout 4 to the timeline. Or you can create your own logo and use it instead. The text and vector position is not in the right place and is too large. It has to be moved to the right place and adjusted. template is written. Instead I write intro. YouTube instead of demo. And OK. You can see that I have changed both texts. Sound must be applied to the vector that I have already dragged to the audio track below. This sound is to be applied as soon as the vector animation is over. It has to be moved forward. You may also hear sound with vector motion. Next, go to media. And add this background video to the top track. Double click on the video. And go to animation and click customize. Now we have a special track. We need to put a keyframe 2 or 3 seconds before the video ends. And its opacity level has to be reduced from 100 to 0. And the second keyframe is to be placed at the end of the video and its opacity level is to be increased from 0 to 100. Now you see how beautiful it looks. Now let us show you how many tracks have been used in this intro project, and how many of them have how many sounds and how many videos. You will see all this. You can make an intro by noting it. Now the intro is ready, let's see. You saw how much professional intro I made in a few minutes. I'm sure this video will be helpful to you. Thank you very much for watching the video. If you want to see more videos like this, I have more great videos like this in this channel. If you want to watch these videos, click links in the description below, and enjoy our free videos. Or visit my channel directly and see everything. And if you enjoyed it, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel and turn those notifications. See you again with a new video. Thanks.